Hey guys, I wanted to show off a few things regarding my UI. Um, you can see what it looks like right here, but I'm going to go over specific add-ons a few at a time just so you get an idea of what I'm using, what they're used for, and how quickly I can see things and make decisions on things because all the information is in my face. I'm going to start with tidy plates because as we can see here I have my target and tidy plates is a replacement nameplate add-on right here it doesn't look like this the factory default uh, nameplate and there's a few benefits to uh, playing with a nameplate add-on the first is you get to uh, choose your uh, options for it uh, right here you see tidy plates has a separate option for main spec and a separate option for off spec because I switch between DPS and tanking there are different mechanics that I need to know for both specs uh, the most important of is threat as you notice I'm not in combat right now the standard color and it's the default color for tidy plates for an enemy is red a neutral one would be yellow and a friendly would be green or non-existent I have it currently set for non-existent until I enable that uh, to enable and disable this it's the same as enabling and disabling your normal nameplates by hitting the default V key I turn it off I turn it on there are a few benefits to playing with a nameplate add-on though um, a few of which are as follows um, the built-in cast bar is much bigger on tidy plates than on the default UI second I get to see the buffs on the target that I particularly have cast and only I have cast and you'll see this in a second I'm going to intercept the target you see the stun duration left in a box in the top left hand corner here see it's got two and one seconds left now my deep wounds was applied and you see that replace it I could add Colossus smash and you'll see that right there that's the benefit of tidy plates also you notice that the characters the target's nameplate turned orange there. If a tank were tanking that target rather than myself attacking the target, the nameplate would default turn to blue because the tank would have high threat on it. If I generate enough threat to pull off the tank, it first turns yellow and then turns that orange color. I'll find a different, I'll use these guys. You notice they both turn orange. I have max threat on both targets. That's the cast bar. I interrupted immediately because I knew that that cast was coming. Again, the nice thing about this is, and I'm going to do this to another group of multiple targets here, um, you could see all instances of all debuffs on the target at the same time. So if I, for example, whirlwinded and got a crit on both targets, you would see deep wounds come up, and I'm going to show that off right now on both targets. Here's the whirlwind. You should now see deep wounds applied to both targets and there it is. I missed the interrupt because I was too far away. But that's one of the benefits of playing with tidy plates um, and not using the default. You get to see all of your own um, debuffs on the target and it just makes everything at a glance much easier to visualize rather than using the uh, the factory defaults and looking for the debuffs on the target where the target's pain normally is up here. Alright, we're back over here again and I just changed specs. I just want to show off the reverse feature of tidy plates of uh, the tanking threat mechanic. Now, I'm going to pick up these guys. They're red now because we're out of combat. I'm going to uh, charge in and they've aggroed to me. They've turned blue. This is the exact opposite of how I have it set up for uh, DPS where um, they are orange if I have top threat. This helps me out a lot because A, if I don't have threat on it, you look at this guy, I don't have threat on him, his bar is much larger, which means it makes it easier to see that, hey, I don't have threat on that target, I may as well go and pick him up. As soon as I get threat on him, it'll change to blue and we're safe because I have threat all my, on all my targets. Again, you can see the, uh, all the debuffs I have, you can see Shockwave, Thunder Armor, uh, Thunderclap, all that good stuff. Um, and that's it for tidy plates. I just wanted to give you guys an idea of what it looks like and what I see when I play. If uh, you guys have any questions, uh, feel free to ask me in game.